guys. So, I was supposed to do this a couple days ago, but I didn't get to. However, this is the wig redone. And it looks pretty good. Now, I have had to do extra stuff to it. As you see, when I flip it around, all this right here, this is what aggravates me. Is that it just kind of all clumps together. However, I can run my fingers through it now. What I did, and I'll put a picture up over here, is I put some oil on it that me and my daughter use for our curly hair to just kind of bring our curls back to life when we're on the, like, not wash days. So, this has seemed to work so far. But again, I just did it last night. So, I'll let you guys know after work today how it goes. But you see that? This is what aggravates me. Maybe that's normal because I've never really had a long wig other than one time I had an extremely long wig um, that was a lot more plasticky than this and it was um, probably down to my butt and it, it held together differently because it was so plasticky and fake but this one so far it's not bad. Like, it just, it aggravates the snot out of me because it keeps tangling up. However, it looks good. Um, I would still give it an 8.5 out of 10. Um, I don't think I'll rate it any higher just because it's, it's should, in my opinion, it should have lasted longer than 10 days before I had to do work to it. I try and give the thought of it that, okay, I wear it every day. Uh, it's not just a night out wig or once in a while wig. This is my everyday hair. So it's going to have more wear and tear on it. Um, also, it's synthetic hair. It's a $100 wig. You're not looking at a $200, $500, or $2,000 wig here. So you're not going to have, you know, that flowy, constant, real hair that doesn't fray as bad. Um, so, that's where I stand on it. Will I buy another one from Candy Lover 89 Probably. Um, I really think that her short wigs would be fabulous because there's not a lot of wear and tear on it because it is short. Um, will I buy another long one? Probably. Honestly, I probably would. Um, especially now that, you know, I know I can fix it halfway decently. And I think to other people, it doesn't look as bad as what I'm seeing that it looks. And I think it's, I'm more going off the texture than looks, just to be honest. Um, but I still enjoy it. I wear it all the time. Uh, so I'll let you guys know if I buy another one and see. But right now, if you know how to take care of one and you know how to fix it, then definitely I would buy one. If this is your first wig ever, I would not because there's you're gonna have to do something different to it. You're gonna have to fix it. You're gonna have to know what you can and can't put on it. Um, so that's kind of where I stand at it. Is it a first time wig? No, um, you need to know what you're doing to it. So. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry if it's a little longer. I'll probably piece it into two just to be honest because it's turning out to be like almost 20 minutes and I don't like to upload 20 minute videos. But I do like it. And again, this is Destiny from Candy Lover 89 at angelicsbeauty.com. Um, so I do. I like it. I'll probably buy another one. Am I like. 100% 10 out of 10 satisfied no but you get what you pay for and it's pretty decent for what you pay for so this is me at my doctor's appointment with my wig looking fabulous it looked great the next day um, but I wanted to give another follow-up the next clip you'll see will be me eight days later hey guys so I've wore the hair for a few days and it doesn't get as knotted up as what it did, um, but I do notice I do have to brush it at least two to three times a day when before it was just a couple. Um, and I would probably say that I'm going to have to redo it at least once a week to straighten it and recurl it. But it's still looking good. Um, I just have to make sure, like I said, to brush it. 
um, more often than what I did before. But so far, so good with the wig and redoing it. I just try and keep some sort of oil on there that I showed a picture of earlier or um, something just to keep it not really slick, but from it catching on each other and tying in a knot. So I'm still going to rate this one an 8.5 out of 10. Would I buy more? My answer is still the same. Yes, I would. Because I think that it's just the fact that it's long. And you, lay, you lean back on it all the time. Um, and like I said, I wear this wig full time. And not just, you know, for outings or random, you know, occasions. This is like one of my full time wigs now. So... I just wanted to follow up with you guys on it just to kind of let you know how it turned out, you know, a few days later after I did straighten it out and recurl it. The curl doesn't really hold, um, but I think that's just me figuring out what temperature to put it on. And I don't use any kind of hairspray or anything with it because it's plastic, so you shouldn't have to. Um, but so far, so good. My rating hasn't changed and I still like her. So thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.